My mother dreams big from the moment she moved from the small confines of her childhood home. The dark alleys that smelled of fish, booze, and piss at the same time at day or night. By day, old hunch women would position themselves to examine the ripe fruits while she had to battle her way past them. She attended three schools, American school to learn English to assimilate herself to mainstream society, Chinese school to retain her native tongue and culture, homeschool where she learned to obey her parents. My mother dreams big. She left her home called Chinatown and her family of six whom she all shared one room. My mother dreams big. From the moment she moved into the small apartment in the Sunset District, in the bright streets that smelled of salty breeze and nature trees, where no one walked the streets except for those who owned pets or jogged. She worked hard to support her husband, three kids, oftentimes underappreciated, yet my mother dreams big. She kicked out my father after six years of marriage for the intimidation and bruises he left and the mess he never seemed to see that she always seemed to clean. My mother dreams big from the moment she raised three boys with the help of family and friends. Despite poor conditions of being overworked, she was and has become our mother, our father, and our friend in the same breath. Physically, she could not cook us a decent meal. <laughs> After working overtime at the hospital, she would use the TV as our babysitter because she simply could not afford one, or cut our hair because she could not afford the barbers. So she deferred her dreams because she simply could not afford time to dream her dreams. So she deferred her dreams, deferred her dreams, deferred her dreams. My mother dreams big. <laughs>